Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be a little bit of a test. I'm going to be making a few videos here that are going to be short, straight to the point, and designed to get you into the video and out with the information you're looking for as fast as possible. So, today I'm going to be telling you about all of my favorite and most used hotkeys inside of DaVinci Resolve, as well as telling you guys what they do and how to effectively use them. Hopefully it's under five minutes. Let's go. The clip that we're going to be using today is just this clip here of some fire. And the first hockey we're going to talk about is B. B is going to get your blade tool and that's going to allow you to make cuts in your footage. That is essential for editing. Next up we have Control Z or I think Command Z on Mac and that is going to undo. You can step back multiple times with this hotkey and it's super useful if you're like, oh crap, what did I just do? Or if you're like, mm, I'm not a huge fan of that. Control Z is undo. Next up, we have Alt. If you hold Alt and use your scroll wheel, you can zoom in and out on your timeline without having to mess with this slider or these buttons. So you just hold Alt, scroll in to zoom in. Easy as that. Next up we have middle mouse click, which is going to allow you to move in your timeline back and forth and up and down if you have multiple video tracks or audio tracks. Next up we have A. So if you hit B and you're in your blade tool, all you have to do to get back to your regular pointer is hit A and then you can grab stuff, move it around, and you won't be slicing anything up. Next up we have N. N is going to be your snapping tool. So we'll go ahead and hit B, cut this, hit A, move it over, and then if we press N, snapping is turned on. So if we get close to that, it's going to snap right to it. But if we press it again and turn snapping off, it's going to overlap it. And next up is going to be Shift 4 and Shift 2. I'm grouping these two together because they're just navigation. So Shift 2 will bring us to our media page and then Shift 4 will bring us to our edit page. So then our next one, I'm going to pop into Fusion. I'm going to hit Shift Spacebar to bring up my Select Tool menu where you can search for any of the tools that you're able to use inside of Fusion, which is an awesome help because then you don't have to find things in your Add Tool menu. You can just Shift Spacebar, search it. And that's going to do it for today's video. Those hotkeys are going to really help you along, they're going to speed up your workflow, and they're going to make your edits better if you use them efficiently. So if you guys like this shorter format of video, please let me know by dropping a like or even telling me in the comments. Make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss any new content, and I will see you guys next Thursday.